What's good, everybody? We are back with another video. So I know, number one, I haven't been posting on this channel a whole lot recently because I've been really busy. And number two, obviously, I'm not in my usual setup. But for mobile gaming and kind of gaming in general, we've got some pretty big news that I wanted to go ahead and cover. And I had a little bit of time today, so I wanted to sit down and talk about something. And that is the release of Fall Guys Mobile. So if you don't live under a rock, then you probably have heard of Fall Guys. It's kind of like the big game in gaming right now. Not because of anything super innovative that the game has done, but just because it's super fun. There's a lot of people playing it and a lot of people enjoying it. And I think it's even despite how huge its release was, has gotten even bigger since then. So a lot of people have been asking for different things about it. One thing to note is it's not out on Xbox, so right now it's only available on PC and PS4. Obviously, as a mobile gamer, I wanted to know if it was going to have a mobile version as well. And today we've got our first news regarding that. So I wanted to go ahead and cover the details of that and everything that you guys need to know. So as you guys can see uh, from this tweet right here, Chinese games and entertainment company Billy Billy has secured the rights to publish a mobile version of Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout in China. The game is released for PC and PS4 on August 4th, 2020, and has become a viral hit. So, one thing to note from this is that it's not officially the game being released worldwide. That being said, whenever a mobile game releases, especially on Android, it basically becomes accessible to the rest of the world. Now, whether or not you're going to need a VPN to play it, or whether you're going to be able to actually understand what the game says is going to be a completely different question, but... From what we've seen in the past, usually there are ways to bypass different things and be able to play most mobile games from anywhere in the world, assuming you have an Android device. Now, if you're on iOS, this is definitely obviously going to be a lot more difficult because Apple is a lot more controlling of their hardware and software, and it's a lot more difficult to get actual access to it. But we do have an official trailer for Fall Guys on mobile. I don't know what the audio levels for this computer are. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to have to go ahead and turn that off. And you guys can kind of watch the trailer. But obviously this is a really, really, really big deal for mobile gaming. As this is kind of the big name in gaming right now. And honestly, Fall Guys... It just makes sense as a mobile game. It's a very, very simple game. So for those of you who haven't played it before, it's basically just an arcade battle royale is effectively what it is. There's a bunch of different arcade games that you can play inside of Fall Guys. And as you play those games, you progress. If you don't make it high enough in the rankings in the game for each specific round, then you get knocked out. And then the last person... To, or that, I guess really in the last game, it's the first person to win or the last person standing ends up being the winner, depending on what game mode you get. So obviously uh, not a crazy complex game, not something that's super well known for how graphically beautiful it is or anything else, but just because it's challenging and fun and a great game to play with friends, obviously this would be something that would be really cool to have on mobile. There have been some questions about whether or not it's going to be pay to play or anything like that. And I don't really know anything about Billy Billy. The main interactions I've had with uh, mobile game developers has been like the prim primary games that release their games in the U.S. And from everything I've seen, I don't think Billy Billy really releases anything in the U.S. So I don't know a ton about them. I have read that they release primarily gacha games, which obviously is not ideal. But hopefully that means that the primary monetization scheme is going to be just through skins and cosmetics rather than actually having to buy the game or like having to buy energy in order to play the game, whatnot, something like that. So overall, I'm really excited about this. I think this is really big news for mobile gaming. And I think in general, this is going to be a really solid addition. But let me know what you guys' thoughts on it are down below in the comments. If there's anything that you feel like I didn't answer, feel free to let me know as well. This is not officially out yet in China, but it is the official announcement that it is going to be coming out in China. And if you actually click on the link, it'll show you the basically like the pre-registration that you can go through on the Billy Billy website to actually go ahead and pre-register for the game so you know exactly when it comes out in China. I can't read anything on the page, and for some reason, it is actually loading, uh, loading insanely slowly right now, but I think we've got the... No, we've only got a partial screen. Maybe because I'm in the United States, I honestly don't know. It loaded fine on my mobile device, so I don't know what the issue is here, but 
like I said, let me know any uh, comments or questions you guys have down in the comments below, and that's going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time.